study what is stationary waves stationary waves are basically standing waves now how are they formed when two identical progressive wave either transverse or longitudinal traveling along the same path but in opposite direction interferes then the resultant wave that is formed is formed in is in the form of loops and thus it is called stationary waves stationary basically means standing waves they aren't moving now what are nodes position at which the vibration of the particle is with minimum amplitude that is displacement is minimum or you can say zero then those points are called as nodes a stationary wave basically comprises of nodes and antinodes now let's see what are antinodes antinodes are the points where the vibration of particle is with maximum amplitude that is the amplitude is maximum at the antinode and it is minimum at the nodes so displacement at antinodes is maximum now the distance between two nodes or two consecutive antinodes is lambda by 2 as you know the wave is of uh, the wavelength of the wave is lambda and the distance between two successive nodes or two successive antinodes as you can see in the diagram is lambda by 2 and if you see the distance between node and an antinode then it is lambda by 4 now stationary wave is doubly per- peri- uh, periodic that is it is periodic in space as well as time now how's that possible it's only because it's not moving and since it's not moving it is periodic in space as well as in time stationary wave is standing wave and thus the velocity of the wave is zero now this is quite clear if something is not moving then it will not have any velocity or velocity would be zero and the energy transfer is also zero since it's not moving thank you